Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel Rishi Labs. In today's video, we are going to see how to download and install Azure Data Studio. So let's get started. For this, you require a web browser. I'm going to use Google Chrome. In search bar, you can type Azure Data Studio download press enter you're going to find the first link download and install azure data studio click on it then you can scroll down over here you can see all the download links for windows mac os and linux so azure data studio is available for all the three platforms so i'll click on x64 that is 64 bit over here you can find the release number of the software and when this software was published so our download is in progress once the file is downloaded you can click on open i'll just minimize the web browser okay so it's a microsoft free software you can click on i accept the agreement click on next over here you can change the default directory of installation but i'm going to keep it as it is so i'll click on next you can click on next if you don't want it to create a start menu folder you can tick mark this but i want it to create so i'll just keep it unchecked click on next over here there are different options create a desktop icon i want it to create a desktop icon so i'll just check it the next is open with azure data studio actions to windows explorer directory context menu so i want these options then register azure data studio as an editor for supported file types okay i'll tick mark this as well then click on next and click on install so it will take few minutes to get it installed All right, so our Azure Data Studio installation has got completed. I'll just uncheck this and click on finish. Over here, you can see on the desktop, Azure Data Studio icon has got created. You can double click this icon to start Azure Data Studio or else you can click on Windows and in search, you can type Azure Data Studio. See, you can find the link or click on Azure Data Studio. So the application has launched over here. You can see the preview features and then, okay, just for the notification, you can ignore it. If you would you like to enable preview features. So whenever a new feature comes up, you know, it is available as in preview mode. So if you want, you can click on yes, recommended. I'll select no for now. Okay. So that's how interface is on. If you click on new, you can create a new connection you can create a new query new notebook or deploy a server so a lot of things are there okay in next videos i'll show you how to use this tool so for now it is just about installation i'll close this application so who can make use of this software so you can one benefit is that Azure Data Studio is available for all the three platforms like Windows. You can install it on Mac OS. You can also install it on a Linux. So the setup file is available over here. You can click and download. So Azure Data Studio is used majorly to connect to a database. There are a lot of file supports for it. We'll see in the next video. Thank you. You can subscribe to my YouTube channel, Rishi Labs. Thank you.